What's up everybody, welcome back to Grab. My name is Tom and on this channel we review the good, the bad and the indifferent health snack products in the market to help you snack that little bit healthier. So if you're into health, fitness or just want to improve your snacking habits now that you've adopted a healthier lifestyle, subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any future content. This video is going to be full of energy. We've got hold of the Grenade Energy Can boasting the natural caffeine, zero sugar and vitamins, electrolytes and BCAAs all in one can. Released late 2019, this product is pretty new to the market, so let's get on with reviewing this product for you and see what it's all about. So to start off with, unlike other um, energy drinks on the market that are usually quite high in sugar, um, this one's boasting zero sugar. Reducing sugar in anyone's diet is usually quite a good positive move. For a pre-workout as well, that's good because usually people want a, a lifting and energizing um, drink before the workout to help them get um, ready and focused. This does that with um, the natural caffeine that's in there. It's boasting here that it's the equivalent um, to two espressos um, in this one can. With the electrolytes in here, um, it's telling us on the can that that's to help us um, maintain that leveled feeling. Often with other energy um, drinks on the market, you can get that peak and that low trough um, after having the drink. Usually um, the side effects of the sugar in there, um, that trough is usually the sugar crash that comes after that. Also in here is the BCAAs and vitamins. So it's vitamin B um, and the BCAAs that help with the recovery um, of the body after the workout. So once you've had your energized boost, you've had your energized workout, your body then needs to rest and recover. Um, and the other benefits of the B vitamins and BCAAs should aid with that recovery. So enough of the boasting that's on the can. Let's get on with actually reviewing this product and see what it's all about. I always love that crack. It doesn't give us a flavour, um, but it smells quite fruity. So let's get on with it and see what it's all about. Mm. Okay. Well, that's kind of interesting. It's very underwhelming. Um, it is slightly carbonated. It's not over carbonated. I'm not feeling like, oh my God, if I finish this full can, I'm gonna be so bloated. So that's a positive. Let's start with the positives. So I'm happy with that. Again, the texture of the water itself with the carbonation is good. You get some light carbonation. It's not heavy carbonation. And the water doesn't, or the liquid doesn't feel too heavy. Um, I've had other cans of energy drinks. Um, and they can't, can, have quite a thick consistency. Um, this one's very smooth, very light. Probably helps with the lack of sugar, or the zero sugar as they claim in here. Um, so again, good positives. However, the overwhelming feeling on this product is it's just slightly underwhelming and a bit meh. I'm a big fan of Grenade. Um, we stock a lot of their products um, in our vending machines and I would recommend um, their bars to anyone that's looking to improve their um, snacking habits to improve a healthier lifestyle. Their bars are some of the best, if not the best products on the market. It feels a little bit like they've rushed this product. Um, like I said, it came out late 2019 and I think maybe it could have done with a little longer um, in product development. Uh, the branding looked fantastic. The product inside doesn't quite live up to that expectation. Maybe I was expecting too much from Grenade. Obviously, they are they start out as um, healthy bars, um, so moving into a liquid format can be quite tricky um, because they are two completely separate um, types of products. But with their sort of prestige behind them, you'd expect a slightly better product from them. It's just not got that punch that I was expecting from it. Um, with an energy drink, I kind of want to have that so excitement in the drink. I know the caffeine takes a little while to kick in. You're looking at about 25 minutes before the caffeine enters that bloodstream and gives you that lift that you're looking for before you work out. But I still wanted something in my mouth that was gonna get me going, oh yeah, I'm having an energy drink, I'm getting going, I'm ready. And sort of already mentally preparing myself for that workout before the caffeine kicks in and, and gives me that physiological uplift while I'm, I'm at the gym. So yeah, I'm just a bit disappointed on that really. Um, I can't pinpoint the flavour in here as well. Is 
it's like I say, it's not got that punch of this is orange or this is strawberry. It's just a bit zesty. It's either got some kind of mild flavouring in there that just has that zesty flavour, whether that's a lime, whether that's a lemon, whether that's a bit of orange. I just really can't work it out at all in here. Um, and it's all just a bit underwhelming. So I want to give you that whole picture. I'm going to get off to the gym. Currently, it's got itself about a five out of 10 and that's been generous because I like grenade. Let's see how I get on with the gym. I'll come back to you when I'm back and give you the complete finished review of this product. So we're back from the gym, having done about an hour in there and um, having had this, it gave me a constant level of energy throughout my workout. Um, I'm still in recovery mode. Um, for those of you that are not aware, I had an ankle operation um, the back end of last year, so I'm still recovering during my workout. So I'm not doing super heavy lifting. Um, I'm not doing a sort of type of crossfit or anything like that. It's simple strength building and cardiovascular to get that range of motion back in that ankle again and building some strength up so I can get back to full fitness. But this sort of helped with a constant level of energy. Um, but the overarching problem with this is it just wasn't it wasn't exciting, it wasn't entertaining. Uh, big build up on the outside with the branding, big let down on the inside. I'm gonna stick with the five out of 10 rating that I gave it earlier. If you are looking to sort of start using a bit of a pre-workout um, and you're obviously controlling how much sugar's in your diet, this might be a nice introduction, but be ready for it to be a bit boring. Um, let me know what pre-workouts you guys are using, what flavors you like. Um, I'd love to get your opinions. Maybe I can create some more content around different pre-workouts. And yeah, let me know if you have tried this product and you've got a different opinion or if you agree with my um, thoughts that it's just a bit meh and a bit boring. Um, like I said, don't let this product put you off grenade products in general. Um, the grenade bars are top of the line. Um, great products to have in your diet um, just for the flavor factor. Um, but this one is just not up there with that. Um, but Hopefully, with Grenade, will do a bit more research and a bit more work on producing a, a better quality product. And I look forward to reviewing that in the future, should that come out. In the meantime, head over to my social media if you want to get in touch, or head to the comments section. Let me know your opinions, thoughts. Um, always love to um, hear what you guys have to say about these types of products. Look forward to seeing you on the next video. Until then, peace.